Hi everyone and welcome uh, uh, here. All right, I'm, I'm gonna just interject here right away. I find doing these uh, kind of update videos to be incredibly boring, not only for me to edit, but I never really have much time to say anything about the uh, about the books that I'll be talking about. And because recently I haven't had the time to continue with the series and uh, uh, going over Descartes' work, I thought I would give an update uh, with uh, with uh, the, the Stygian collection and just kind of uh, in general what I've been what I've been reading. More so to to, to just uh, show what I'll be going through uh, after I finish uh, uh, um, going through the work of of Descartes. But I decided to uh, uh, record this after uh, being awake for for uh, far too long. I didn't realize how nonsensical I actually came across, but it, it, it does make it somewhat a little more entertaining for me to edit. But because I, I do really like these books I'm about to talk about, I do want to give something on them. So I thought I'd just interject here and there uh, uh, and kind of just provide commentary on this complete uh, chaotic disaster of me trying to communicate. Plus, this might be a bit more entertaining, as there's a lot of uh, 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 this. I don't know if, 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 if anything I'm saying is making any sense. And uh, this, I'm not going to say that. And, and somehow this? Uh, I caught I caught a rat, and at times I just forget that I'm I'm even recording and just start reading. Anyway, here's 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 an update. I thought I'd take a break from uh, doing a, uh, the the Descartes series that I, I've 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 been working on, as I've I've been spending most of my time with uh, uh, editing these 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 stories in the Stygian anthology that that uh, we're putting out. So uh, yeah, this will be a bit of a shorter one, which is fine with me, really. This is this is this is why I I, 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 I typically will, will if 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 you see my videos and you notice that 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 that, that, that every sentence is just cut. That's that's because this is what's in between all of that all of that. It's it's nothing but hours and hours of 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 stuttering and and rambling, and, and which is why it takes about a whole week of of editing just to cut everything to make it coherent. And it still isn't. Anyway, I, f I forget why I pressed record on this in uh, in the first place. So um, I'm just gonna start talking about uh, the, the 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 books I'm currently reading because that was, I think, the, ori the original the I think that was the original intent of, of this. And I'm not even done the introduction. I was at a coffee shop. It was it says it's a 24-hour coffee shop, but I was there for 41 hours and they never kicked me out. I'm not sure why I mentioned the coffee shop, but it was, it was, that was actually kind of funny, I, I think. So, uh, so I'm still working on that, and I know it's not everyone's favorite thing, so I thought just throwing in the, the typical kind of booktube video would, 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 would be alright. Uh, I don't know how this is going to work. And um, all of these books that I'm going to be mentioning here, I, I do hope to uh, talk about them uh, in further detail later on. I'm hoping to get uh, a few of these people on the channel to talk about it. Anyway, the first book I was going to mention here is one titled Aphesis by uh, Tradon Lenat, The Impossibility of Subjectivity. I'm not sure why I decided there to say half of the title and then the author's name and then the rest of the title. But yeah, it's it's a thesis, The Impossibility of Subjectivity. That's uh, uh, by Tradon Lenat. It's okay. And, and, and if, I, if I were to be someone that made a top 10, top 5 books of the year, which I don't, but if I, if I did, which I guess kind of right now I, I, I am, this would, this would definitely make that list. In fact, it would make the list for the, the, the preface alone, which, which in the preface, he, he indirectly gives one of the best uh, responses to the, uh, to the uh, theological issue of uh, uh, the problem of evil. And though I, it's not directly stated, I would, I would, I would really like to hear, hear his thoughts on that. And here is uh, where I kind of just forgot I was recording, and I just start reading the first chapter. I don't, for about 30 minutes, uh, I'm not 
sure what I... Anyway, the uh, book does take a close look at the ontology of uh, self-relation, claiming that the most consistent uh, form uh, is that of the drive ontology. And to give this idea the, the attention it deserves, I'll have to just put out a whole video on that. But as far as what I mentioned in passing there, issue of uh, uh, the problem of evil, I shouldn't, I probably shouldn't just throw something like that out there, but um, there, there might be, there might be something there, but I, I haven't really put too much thought into it. Um, he does mention the work of uh, Florensky, who I who I haven't read, and I guess this is where where uh, the ontology of communion is uh, is really more developed. Before before I talk any more on this on this work, I'll have to read some of uh, Florensky. But as I said, I'll I'll I'll, I'll, I'll discuss this uh, in further detail. Yeah, I I guess I did think everyone just wanted to hear me read the first chapter there. Uh, another book I'm uh, currently reading is one by Cadell Lass, who also has uh, some of the best uh, in introduction lectures I've, I've, I've heard on, on, on uh, Hegel's Phenomenology of Spirit. But it's uh, Systems and Subjects, Thinking the Foundations of Science and Philosophy. I go on and on here, but never really get to anything about the book mainly because I'm, I'm not done it yet. So I really don't have much to say, but I will provide uh, two videos below, one by Cadell Last and another by uh, OG Rose. But I can say of, uh, uh, as of right now, that if you're not, if you're not uh, as well versed in some of the continental philosophers that he, he's, he brings up here, that being uh, Heidegger, uh, Hegel, Nietzsche, and Freud, Last has done a really great job of taking some of these complex ideas and, and incorporating it into, into uh, uh, the specific lens he's looking uh, at them under, which is to say it's, it's, uh, you don't need, you don't need uh, to be an expert on Heidegger or Hegel to, to, uh, uh, to follow this. And, and I, I, can, I can tell the moment I, I am done it for the first time, it will be right back to page one. Both Cadell Last and O.G. Rose put out uh, videos uh, discussing it in, in much better detail than I could hear. And speaking of O.G. Rose, he, he does have another book uh, uh, that will be released here this year. And if you watch his channel, you might remember that he came out with a book that seems not too long ago. And the reason why it might seem like it wasn't too long ago is because it, it wasn't too long ago. That being the collection of essays, uh, uh, this one here. Uh, the, uh, thoughts. The official release date will be released, I think he said, uh, next week? But I was told it would, uh, it's, uh, it'll be somewhere either May, May or June. What month are we in? What year are we in? But I was told this, this, this has been, uh, in the works since 2016. I hope I'm remembering all those dates right. Belonging again is a, is an attempt to answer the question of what happens when what is a given or quote unquote objectively true or accepted as an objective truth uh, begins to retreat away from being an unrecognized social constraint and we are then confronted with with uh, a choice ultimately confronting uh, a question on shared values which which breaks the bond that these these givens may have had in the past to a uh, bond a society together. That which was at one point a given is now in question. And of course they give reasons for showing this, and it's it's of course much more involved than, than that. Anyway, as, as uh, he states it in uh, the beginning there, it's not so much a matter of uh, where we go from here uh, as well as questions on where it is we even are, but also uh, he, he takes a look at uh, how it is we got here. And, and again, uh, once, once I'm actually finished that book, I'll, I'll be able to say a lot more on that as well. So. If there was a cut that seemed to like jump from one subject to the next without any uh, coherence whatsoever, that's just because I've I've completely forgotten what 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 I what I've already said. I've 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 been here all day. I don't think I've said anything in in the hours I've, I've been sitting here. Another thing I, I wanted to to mention. <laughs> Uh, just in, in case I haven't, if you hear a, a, a cat in the background, that's that's because um, there's a cat in the background. I don't know why I'm saying that. 
This is this isn't what I'm, I'm like in real life, by the way. Not even kind of. And I'll probably end up deleting this one eventually if I ever put it out. Yeah, I'll I'll be deleting this one as well. I, I don't know why I would keep this on the internet. I don't know why I'm saying this right now. I don't know why I'm doing any of this, to be completely honest. I don't I don't want to do this anymore. This is a complete mess, and I, I really don't want anything to do with it. I'm, a, I'm also going through, uh, once again, uh, basic concepts of Aristotelian philosophy of Heidegger's. Explain, I don't know how to explain any of this. This sounded so much better before any of it was actually said out loud. I, uh, I, I don't know what it is I'm doing anymore. Another thing I uh, want to uh, mention um, before I completely go off again is I'll, I'll be uh, making my way to Toronto here real soon. And I've been rereading uh, uh, Davout's book, Experimental Psychology and Human Agency. And uh, I, we, I just uh, spoke to him, who, who also is in, in, in the Toronto area. And so we'll, we'll be discussing uh, uh, some, some uh, topics mentioned here. Actually, it was this book that uh, got me started uh, to work on a, a series in regard to, to uh, Sartre's notion of free will, which if you're thinking, I don't remember you ever putting that video out, it's because I never did. And I kind of explained why in, in, in uh, that video I put out uh, the difference between talking philosophy and talking about philosophy. Because uh, as, as I continued to work on that series, I ended up back uh, at, at Aristotle's metaphysics. And then, I, and then I ended up writing the whole series in, 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 on a single Greek word, which is actually where, where Heidegger comes in. As, as, as I, I've, always, I've always liked his interpretations of, of, of Aristotle. But in any case, uh, so um, yeah, I hope to sit down with uh, Davoud uh, when I head to Toronto. Um, I, I don't remember when that is, and I just, I just, uh, I just, I just, told, I just, I replied to him. That wasn't a sentence. But in any case, uh, I will be talking more about this book, either with David or, or even I might even just put out a, a separate video and then have a uh, conversation with David. I don't know how, how we're going to do that yet. But, but in any case, that, that, that'll hopefully happen eventually. But I do know there is at least one other uh, book I wanted to, uh, wanted to mention here. And, and it's actually not, not uh, philosophy or psychology. But for those who have been watching this channel for a while, when it comes to genre fiction, science fiction is usually my, my go-to when I take a break from what I typically am, 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 am reading. Tom from uh, uh, Tom L.A. Books put out a graphic novel, uh, Genu, which I, I, I'd read the first part uh, over a year ago now at, uh, uh, as he sent it to me, but it only recently came out uh, uh, as a full, full graphic novel. And I never ended up getting around to it because it came out around the same time I was moving and I was just way too busy to do anything. And then I completely forgot about it. But as I was going through um, some, some books I had piled up over here, I came across it and I just remembered that it exists. And from what I remember, I really liked it. And so I'm gonna, I'm gonna finally get around to reading the full story here. And, and my apologies to Tom for, for forgetting it. I, I really shouldn't have. But like I said, I received it at such a crazy time that I, I, I probably have a few books that I got from around then that I just kind of put in a corner and, and, and have completely forgotten about. But I do know uh, uh, Tom, who, who's, who's, whose favorite uh, sci-fi author is also my favorite sci-fi author, that being um, Arthur C. Clarke. And Tom being a, a primary writer uh, uh, of this one, I can, I can say, Safely sure it's 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 gonna be worth worth the read. So yeah, I think I think I should probably be done rambling, even though I feel I don't know if I said anything. So yeah, this is just gonna be a, a, a collage of the last few hours of of my my performative uh, uh, nature of, of of existence. I kind of want to just make a whole series of videos of just, 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 just single lines taken from philosophers that are completely out of context. A line is indeed destroyed by being divided into halves. They also said that the bodies in the heavens are ten, and since there are only observed to be nine, they made the anti-earth the tenth. It would be like taking issue with a vegetable. Anything that is produced is produced by something. And by this, 
I mean that from which the origin of the production comes. Yeah, I don't, I don't think that needed further explanation. That's that's all just from from a, a granted a terrible translation of uh, the metaphysics. Anyway, I've wasted a lot of time today. Well, I guess that's 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 it. And I think at this point I'm just stalling because I know what comes after is somehow even worse. And that's just the editing of it all. I think with the with the with the more serious videos, uh, uh, obviously this not being one of them, I, I may just start um, uh, putting up a photo and and just speaking over it because I I I can't do this anymore. No, I'll, I'll, I'll continue to suffer through it. I mean, I'll be doing it one way or the other. I can't remember how I, exactly I, I ended uh, that video. In fact, I can hardly remember recording it at all. Anyway, I'm gonna uh, go now. But yeah, uh, the next video I will um, be back with Descartes. Not literally, but uh, talking about his work. He's, he's actually never been here. Unless... No, no, that's, that's not possible. Where did that rat go?